it's Izzy Dixon here again from Well Organized Marketing and in today's blogging tip I would like to talk about blogging for photographers and why it's a really good tool to grow your photography business. Um, there are several reasons why uh, blogging is a good tool for photographers. Number one is it's a it's a great way to show your expertise. You can um, not just share your photography as in your images your pictures but you can write about the background so how did you get to that shot why did you use um, that shot as opposed to a different angle that sort of thing um, you can share your knowledge your tips your advice and remember to be generous because the more you share the more you will be seen as an expert uh, another reason is local exposure. A photography, uh, unless you're of course a world-class photographer, photography tends to be quite local. So you will, uh, most businesses, most private indiv individuals will be looking for a local photographer and type that into Google. So if you then talk about uh, photo shoots you have done locally, um, you that will be picked up by Google so they will pick up place names things like that um, and uh, that will then give you more local exposure so if somebody looks for a photographer in Nottingham um, you are a photographer in Nottingham you write about photo shoots in and around Nottingham mentioning the word Nottingham um, in case you're wondering yes I live in Nottingham um, then Google will pick that up and show your results more than somebody else's um, finally, you will also never be stuck for blog graphics because you have images that you can use. Whether that, whether those are images that the ones that you talk about in the article or just other ones that just illustrate uh, a similar point or illustrate the headline that you've chosen, um, anything like that. So you have the material for blog graphics simply because you take pictures all the time. Um, there are, of course, like with anything else, pitfalls to avoid, especially uh, for for you guys, for photographers. Um, and those are together with more tips in the related blog post. Link is, as always, in the description of this video. Um, so please click through to that. If you found today's tip useful, um, please share um, on social media. Um, if you know a photographer, if you're not one you yourself, but if you know somebody who does photography as a business, please share this video with them. They'll hopefully find that useful and it will help them with their business as well. So yeah, if you find it useful, as I said, please share, please hit like, subscribe to my newsletter, which comes out once a week with the latest blog post, the latest video, so you never miss an update from me about blogging, blogging tips, blogging strategies, etc. So I share a lot as well. Yeah, with that, I hope you have a great week and I'll see you next week with the next tip. Take care now.